Hello, Scorpio, and welcome to your Coffee Cup reading for the week ahead of August 24th through the 30th. And this is a very general reading. Okay, so what do we have here for Scorpio? Scorpio. This can be a very fast-moving week, okay? So it's like a lot high energy from what I'm seeing, but... You have to be a little cautious, okay? Don't kind of trip over yourself, so to speak, okay? So don't do anything haphazardly as well. Um, I do see here a home, family, uh, people close to you that is coming into focus as well, okay? But you will be getting a lot of things, a lot of things under control that have been a little bit chaotic too, Okay? Scorpio, you've got an up and down week. I have to say this. It's um, up and down, so to speak. Okay, you will, like I said, get a lot of things under control, but it's like kind of fast paced or just things just coming at you. Now, you have to be more grounded. There is a sense of building upon your home foundation. Okay, that's good. This is something solid, uh, building upon solid ground, um, working on something as well. I do see um, feminine energy, a lot of feminine energy around too. So you could be dealing with females. Okay. Um, I do see. Yeah, it's like, be careful of anyone. There's a sense that someone is very dramatic or there's a sense of too much drama or this person may be exaggerating something or try to draw you into drama. That is just for some of you. It is a very general reading. So just be careful of that energy. Uh, definitely for some of you, this is for someone out there, you're building upon your own business. Um, this is owning your own business. This is, um, this could be into, this could be like art deck, um, home decorate, decor. I don't know if I'm saying it right. Home design, um, any kind of business. It can be in the beauty business too. So I'm seeing something like that as well. I do see, um, you're drawing in a lot of people, too, and a lot of attention for good or bad, okay? Now, you are surrounded by some kind of jealousy. This could be a, a female, too, who's either jealous or she's um, living kind of vicariously through you. So I'd be careful of her. Uh, don't let her bring you down. Um, she may be talking bad about you because out of jealousy. That is just for some of you. It's, it's surrounding you there. Um, you have to stay more positive because I see, you know, you could be dragged down into disappointment or some of you could be even dealing with depression. All right. And then I see, you know, the energy goes up again. So I do see a wish fulfillment. Okay. Very happy energy coming through too. So that's looking good. But then it goes right into feeling used, feeling hurt. Um, someone, uh, maybe, but you know, you feel betrayed. Maybe someone was there, you thought they had your back and they just kind of don't, you know, there's a sense of realizations. There's a lot of picking up and starting all over again. Okay. I do see don't make any quick moves, any decisions, unless you have all the information. Don't assume anything as well. There is to me a very strong life altering energy here too is possibility. All right. So, uh, I mean, you have almost like a tower effect here, too. So I do see endings, sudden changes, things like that. And this can be karmic. This is things beyond your control. This could be just um, people around you or just some situations. I do see that there is some deception around you as well. Okay, you may be dealing with some delays. All right, but I do see some of you thoughts are moving, leaving some things behind. Okay, so I do see that energy coming, too. This could be a getaway or some kind of travel, and it's well needed <laughs> as well. I do see there's some music. Um, you may go out listening to music. Um, listening to music is very soothing, or there could be something that kind of, you know, gives you an epiphany. So I do see that energy coming through. Some of you may be dealing with a Taurus or a Taurus type of energy. You are coming to new beginnings. You have quite a few energies here, too. There's like Aquarius or someone who exhibits those energies, a Libra. Um, Libra as well is showing up here. So you got to like air energy here as well. 
there is something that you're just not happy about, okay? But you're allowing too many doubts or pessimistic or unhappy thoughts to come through. So it's, you have to kind of fight that, you know, we do go through things and then we just need to kind of move forward and try to get out of our funk, so to speak, okay? Um, it's quite a bit of uh, scattered energy, chaotic energy this week. So it's like uh, very fast moving, slowing down is going to be very important. This can be something very significant that's rushing into. Um, I would be careful also, you know, you could be more accident prone because you're not focusing. So don't trip over yourself, so to speak. So it's an up and down week from what I'm seeing in general here with um, Scorpio. Um, like I said, it's a very general reading though, okay? All right. Uh, yeah, that's all I see. All right, Scorpio, follow me on Instagram. I do post daily readings and within those daily readings is also daily birthdays, all in one. Um, I hope you have a wonderful week for the week of August 24th through the 30th. And I'll catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best and bye for now.